hi guys welcome back to the channel it's a scene tarot so right now we're going to jump into your message to see what's going on for you for the next month this is going to be an overview so hopefully it resonates with you if it does remember to like this video give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel and if it doesn't resonate i will have a link in the description box for you as well okay which would be your playlist also i have my instagram so if you guys want to go over there and support as um, soon as we reach a 5k goal on the instagram we're definitely starting those free personal readings live on there so if that's something you want to you know enjoy with me or join with me the link would be in the description box for you okay so scorpio let's see what the angels have for you when it comes to your overview thank you angels for being here with us today what's going on for scorpio overview what messages do you have for scorpio overview thank you scorpio overview for the next month Okay, Scorpio, I'm seeing the Four of Swords here, the Knight of Cups. I'm also seeing the third of the Three of Wands, excuse me. I'm seeing the Seven of Cups here, and I'm also seeing the Sun in Reverse. Scorpio, I'm feeling like you need to look out for anything or anyone that's going to cause you to actually go backwards in life. I'm definitely feeling like there might be some over overwhelming feelings that you're struggling with with these individuals um energy coming into your life for some of them it might be love for some of them it might be something to do with family as as well that you are off and on with like you know this person comes into your life this person re is releasing themselves from your life playing games with you in a way i feel like this person could be dramatic like take things out of proportion as well that wants to actually do this to you back and forth i don't feel like they don't have love for you i feel like yes they do but the things that they do is kind of questionable um scorpio and i feel like you go through a lot of like in and outs when it comes to your mind your mental um struggles here your mental health that you need to very much protect with this energy and i feel like it's because the love that you have for this person that is caused um, all of this mental struggles okay this could also be um, affecting your spiritual struggles as well knowing that this looks like a, a a tomb but yet very spiritually you know blessed for your 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 for, for it to be your resting place so please look out for that energy i feel like there's going to be a lot of choices that are going to be coming towards you a lot of opportunities as well and i don't feel like this is going to be something that you enjoy um i feel like this is something that is going to be overwhelming to you you're going to have to release this like you're just like these are just being a pest to you for some reason like you um experienced these things before and you don't want nothing to do with them again and i feel like you're gonna have to talk to someone or share your thoughts because it's kind of overwhelmed with overwhelming you at this moment and these could actually be people that want to be with you or try with you but you're just not interested and i feel like you're going to need to put your foot down because all of these things here that i'm seeing is like not making you happy in the sun they're not fulfilling your joy or your your, your bliss it's not helping you to grow and it's just affecting your strength in leo okay it's affecting who you are as a person and i feel like you're gonna have to make a decision about that you're overwhelmed with it so yes you're gonna have to make a decision about that but opportunities are coming in your way okay when it comes to the three of pentacles pentacles oh my god <laughs> i slapped myself with the, the three of wands you guys there's going to be opportunities coming your way and i feel like you're going to be thinking about this overthinking about this wondering if you should go right you should go left should you go straight i feel like you need to trust your intuition and don't think about this too much i feel like you don't need to put your energy into something um too much and if you have to think about it before making a decision then you know this is not the right opportunity for you right so start trusting yourself scorpio this is what i'm hearing when it comes to your your overview here okay i'm seeing in the next three months this is what i'm seeing here um for some of you i, I think this opportunity is being gone for a period of time and this might not be what you want for yourself okay or what you can handle right now And this is a also i'm feeling like this might be a past energy as well 
where you have to make a decision on things that keeps coming back up. Like you're like, like opportunities are coming your way and then you, you, you don't make it a move on it and it's coming back again with these three of wands. Okay. All right. So I have the strength here. Okay. Which is really good in Leo coming up again. We did have the sun. Okay. In your overview, which was telling me you're struggling when it comes to your bliss, but we have the strength card here. So this is good. We have the ace of wands in reverse. We have the four of pentacles in reverse. I feel like we have the six of cups in reverse. We have the queen of wands in reverse. Okay. So I feel like with everything that's going on in your life, Scorpio, I don't feel like you're one of those people that have grudges or have bad energy towards anyone if anything you're being very nurturing and very kind and trying to make sure that everyone is around you is blessed and taken care of as best as you could okay as best as you could and i'm also seeing the strength here so everything within you you're taking everything within you to make things right or to feel um things out and to actually solve any conflict that you need to address this is what i'm seeing i feel like it might be this um this conflict here, okay, that you are dealing with, with the seven of cups in reverse and your happiness, your bliss, like you don't feel like any kind of, you know, um, con happy conclusion is going to end with these choices here. You're kind of overwhelmed with the same kind of pattern that you are attracting, okay? Whether it is jobs, whether it is friendships, whether it is, you know, um, a relationship, really, it's like the same situation that you want out of your life and it's coming back into your life, all right? And you feel like you have to talk to someone because you're going a little bit crazy and cuckoo with this situation here, all right? So I feel like you're gonna put an end to any kind of relationships that is not passionate for you and it's not healthy for you because I'm feeling like somebody like Scorpio Cancer might be coming towards you or you might be coming towards someone. So keep this in mind, you guys, this could be in reverse, this message, but I feel like someone is coming towards you, okay? That you really just don't want to entertain anymore. There is something missing there. You don't feel like there is an opportunity there anymore. You don't feel like this person and you can make this work or come to some kind of peaceful resolution within this. You're not feeling hopeful within this. And I feel like you need to really focus on your money as well, Scorpio. When it comes to your money, when it comes to your spending, I see that you're holding on to a lot of things because you are losing a lot of things. I feel like you're giving away your money. You're buying things for people that you can't right now because you want to see everyone happy, you know, around you, especially your close, um, loving family, the people that you truly love, the people that you truly, you know, is going to be there for you. You want to make them happy. You're the kind of person, Scorpio, if you can't afford a house for someone, you're going to get it for that person. And you don't even care about the money. You're not even going to ask for the money. Money come to you and money go. That's not the most important thing for you. Your love, that's the most important thing. The love that you get back from people as well. That I'm seeing the six of cups here and the, the nurturing, your nurturing energy, making sure that everybody's successful, making sure that everybody's taking care of everybody's love. Everything is growing. Look at this. Everything is prosper and you're all about prosper and prosperity. Okay. Giving everyone something like you're, you're using your hands to make sure they're nurtured and cared for, like you're caring for someone you're acting like for those females out there, a motherly figure for those males out there, a fatherly figure. You're making sure that everyone is around you is blessed. Everyone that you have healthy relationships with people that you have childish relationship with that you constantly think about. And this could also be love as well. You guys, someone from your past, um, dealing with past situation, past love conflicts that you want to address. I feel like, um, this could be someone that you left or someone that entered out of your life or, you know, yeah, entered out of your life in trying to return. But I feel like even with this, you don't have any kind of hateful memories. You're all thinking about positive memories with each other here. So it might be a chance for you to even nurture this if it's a love situation, but it could just be a family tree with your mother, your father, and your siblings, okay? That you're really just like trying to have back in your life and build that relationship. So let's see what else for the conclusion for this overview. For this overview, please, for Scorpio. You see, guys, I am up all night with y'all doing videos, y'all. <laughs> oh, 
my God. Is this so amazing? I'm like, you know what? Today is Thursday and I forgot today was actually overview day. And I was busy doing Scorpio singles read. Okay, so I'm going to do it tomorrow as well just because. Tomorrow's Friday and you guys don't get a video from me until Monday. That's if I feel up to it. I'll do a video for you on on the over the weekend. OK. All right. So we have the Knight of Swords. We have the Page of Wands. We have the Five of Cups here. We have the Seven of Wands in reverse. We have the Judgment. OK, so definitely there's a decision that is made here. Okay, on your end, when it comes to you, there's a chapter that is definitely closed in your life. And I feel like whoever was actually mean to you or trying to harm you, Scorpio, or defeat you or to take your dream, to take your plans, to take your, your ideas, things that you actually put your hands within and worked for is going to be judged here. And I feel like this is what the judgment is all about because I'm seeing that you're letting this go in Libra. For some of you are dealing with a Libra, you're dealing with a, a Leo energy that's coming out here as well. I feel like those are the only signs, like major cards that's actually coming up out of these readings. But we do have like Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces element, Aries, Leo, Sag elements as well. Who else do we have here? And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. We have other little elements as you know, the four of swords, like air signs and stuff like that. But I'm talking about like real signs that can actually point down what this is all about okay oh okay gemini aquarius libra energy i'm also getting libra energy here you see what i'm saying in the judgment major card so all right you guys let me just say like i was saying is a decision that's made and and it's because of this person that's been two-faced fake to you and this could have been multiple people that actually did this to you and you made a decision to make things you know calm down by walking away from this person and exit it exit in this conflict you're not going to entertain this anymore this is what you're saying right and i feel like for some of you, you feel very disappointed in this person because this is someone that you really you know wanted to be in your life for a very long time you put a lot of energy into this person and this person really backstabbed you and made you feel like you know a certain way really down about yourself you know really doubting who you are as a person and taking away a lot of your self-esteem and question yourself questioning yourself here and i feel like this is going to be something that this person regret because of the judgment you know this is set the angels are protecting you're divinely um protected from your angels um scorpio and i need you to know that because look the angels are all over this you see the angels there protecting you okay so I'm definitely feeling like this person is going to want to talk to you and try to make things right with you this is what I'm seeing here after everything that they have done to you and how they made you feel I feel like there is going to be like this energy of them thinking about you a lot here I feel like every time they they have this new idea of how they can make this right they're excited about this they have a passion behind it they're inspired about this so they're going to come to you you. yes they're scared but they feel like you're going to give them another chance okay this is someone that could be jealous of you as well i just need you to understand and i need you to like protect yourself from this energy a very immature energy okay i feel like this person is driven by ideas inspiration and things that they can make money of okay they're learning but the way they're coming off is very immature. So if this is an idea, like say you worked with this person and this person stole your idea and take your shine from you, they don't feel any way about this. Okay. Yes, they do regret the way they did it after people see who they truly is. Okay. And how they made you look. Cause I feel like what they did, it made no sense at this, at this position or this, you know, this, if this is at work situation. I don't feel like it made no sense because everybody know who you are and what you are capable of and what you're going to create. And that was yours. That was your idea. That was your inspiration. You was behind this open in this business or something like that. You know, um, your family taking care of your family. If this is a family thing, they know what they did, you know, but no one wants to say anything to the face because it's going to cause a dramatic situation because 
because again, you're dealing with someone that is very dramatic. Um, I mean, they do care for you. Okay. But at the same time, they're very dramatic. They take things out of, out of proportion. And most of the times because of that, you have to find yourself and protect your mental state. You have to run away, walk away from this person. This is what I have for you in your overview. You guys, I told you it was going to be simple. It's going to be quick. And this is what you have to watch out for, for the whole month. Love you guys. And if it resonates, you know what to do. Like this video, um, give this a big thumbs up here on the channel. Also, you guys, uh, the playlist will be down below in the description. Go over to the Instagram, support your girl on there. As soon as I hit the 5k mark on the gram, I would definitely start those free personal readings over there for you. And also guys, thank you so much for your your love and support and i'll see you guys in your next one bye guys